the number of divisions on the circular scale n is equal to 100. Therefore, least count that is LC of the micrometer is equal to P upon n is equal to 0 0.1 upon 100. Hence, least count of the screw attached to the frame F1 is equal to 0 0.001 centimeter. Let us add some weight to the hanger so that the experimental wire becomes free of kinks. Call the hanger as dead weight as it is not taken into calculation. The screw attached to the frame is used to make spirit level horizontal. To avoid backlash, the screw should be rotated in one direction. Note the direction of rotation needed to lower or to raise the tip of the micrometer screw. Adjust the screw so that the air bubble in the spirit level is at the center. It means that the spirit level is horizontal. Note the readings on the main scale and also the circular scale D. Note these in table 2. Observation number 1. Mass M equal to 0 as there is no weight added to the hanger. Main scale reading 0 0.1 centimeter. CS 71. Total reading 0 0.0171. Add a weight of 500 grams to the hanger on the experimental wire A. Wait for about one minute as the increase in the length of the wire occurs rather slowly. Observe, the bubble in the spirit level has moved from the center. Rotate the screw so that the air bubble in the spirit level is brought to the center. Note the readings when air bubble becomes steady. This is observation number 2. Add mass of 500 grams successively and note the readings 4 more times. Let us slowly unload in steps of 500 gram and note the corresponding reading in table 2. For mass M0, find the mean reading X1 of the two readings corresponding to loading and unloading. Similarly, Find the mean of other reading corresponding to different masses. Now, we find the elongation E due to the mass M by taking the difference of mean reading corresponding to that mass from the reading corresponding to no mass, that is X1. Thus, elongation due to mass 500 grams is given by X2 minus X1. Similarly, find the elongation due to other masses and note these carefully in table 2. Also, let us find the elongation due to mass 1000 grams by taking the differences x3 minus x1, x4 minus x2, x5 minus x3, x6 minus x4. The mean elongation for 1000 gram is found by taking mean of the above values. We get E is equal to 0 0.039 centimeter. Please note this mean is required to find Young's modulus by calculation.